What it fellas, the I'm Jesse here, right back for another LEGO Avengers 2020 set review for you guys. And this time, I'm reviewing another set for the lineup, and that is Falcon and Black Widow team up. It's at 40418, it ages 8 plus, it has 60 pieces and 4 minifigures. Now, my mom got me this set at LEGO Shop at home back in September for the lineup. So, without further ado, let's take a look at the minifigures first. So first up, let's start off with one of the new exciting exclusive figures in the set, and that is Falcon. Now this is the new comic book version for the lineup. He is exclusive to the set, and this is the only set that you could get him in a cheaper price. But anyways, he is so freaking cool. My god, I love this version of Falcon. Holy crap, he is so damn cool looking. And I totally love... These brick bill wings right there, as you can see, different than the Affinity War one from the MCU. And I totally love the dual molded legs with the lights red and the white right there. Love the face and torso printing and even the hairpiece from Finn from the Star Wars saga lineup. And the wings itself are on a ball joint, as you can see. That explains that part right there, as you can see, which is so nice. Same thing with the left wing right there. I totally love the gold hands. Yeah, holy crap, I totally love all its glory. Yeah, the glory and stuff is what I'm trying to say. I love the goggles and the smiley face. Looks so nice. I like that falcon symbol in gold with the belt, the red, and the white right there. And yes, he is wearing a sleeveless shirt right there, as you can see, which is so freaking cool looking. And here we have his back of his wings right there, as you can see, which is so nice. And also, he does have a double-sided face. Let me try to take his freaking hair off right there. There we go. Now, here we have his second face. Now, this is the serious look, as you can see, which is so freaking cool looking. Now, let's take that off so I can show you what his back torso printing looks like. Alright, there we go. Now, let's put all that back on. There we are. So here we have his back torso pretty. This is what it looks like. And we have the back side, the dual molded legs. And even on the side right there for the left uh, right leg for Falcon right there. And yes, I'm so happy that I got this version. So I do have two MCU versions right there. But this is the first time for the comic book one. This is not for the Avengers video game one. But this is the comic book Falcon that I really like so much for this freaking set. So that is it for Falcon. And here we have the same new Black Widow minifigure. Now, this look of her is literally the same one from the Avengers Tower, the Helicarrier, and even this set too. Well, yeah, she only appears only a few sets for the summer way for the sets for the lineup. And she does come with those Black Widow blades right there. Yes, they are black this time as you can see so let's set that aside right there and she does have that same red hair piece right there that head and hair look is the same part look from the mcu solo film black widow from the helicopter chase and the torso and leg printing is the same one from the other sets including the avengers tower and the avengers helicarrier right here and also the arm printing is the same exact one from the different freaking set. So this is for the right arm. And same thing with the left arm right there. So yeah, all that is uh, literally the same freaking thing that we got for for a lot of times for the lineup. As you can see, well, it's still cool. You love the Black Widow symbol right there, which is really nice. And here we have the back of her right here. So the back of her is the same once again. And we take off her hairpiece. The rest of her back torso printing and the second face is literally the same. But I'm still happy that I got this Black Widow, but she is so damn cool looking. So, that is it for Black Widow. And finally, we have these AIM Troopers again that I'm sick and tired of getting them. So, yes, they are the same. You do get two of them in this set right here. But yes, uh, they are the exact same figures that we got before for God's sake. Come on now, and both of them do come with a black alien conquest gun with that light yellow stud piece connected right there. So we're going to set that aside, 
and set this knucklehead aside. Now we got this figure before in a lot of these sets for God's sake. Come on now. Now the face and torso printing is literally the same. All that printed bull crap that we've gotten before from the first and second wave of sets for the Avengers game. But yes, we do have those classic dark gray legs right there. And we have the same torso printing that says aim on its chest. And even the mouth mask is literally the same as so as the helmet is all the same. And here we have his back torso printing, which is the same one. And if you guys don't know what their face print looks like under that mask, this is what it looks like once again. So, that is it for the minifigures in this set. And the only build in this a cheap set is this little aim machine gun in this set. So, this is the stud shooter gun. Yes, we had this stud shooter machine gun that we've gotten before in different sets. And yes, so this is the only build in this set. So this is a small set, and which means this is the small build in this set right here. So this is the front of it, as you can see, which is really nice right there, which is so freaking cool looking right there. So this is what the top of it looks like. And yes, they're not using some green studs. They're using green cylinders right there. So that is really cool. I really like that, which is really neat. So here we have the bottom of it, as you can see. So here we have the side of it, as you can see, which is so nice right there, which is really cool. Here's the other side of the machine gun, which is really nice right there. Here we have this whole back section right there, which is nice. And also, you can bend this. You can bend it up. You can make it totally straight like this, or a little bit down. It goes down a little bit because those pieces, well, that piece only is blocking away, or this one right there. And the only play feature is, it's the same gimmick with these machine stud shooters. So, let me try to, all right, there we go. So, yes, it's easy to fire all that out. I only fire three of these. Now, if you lose one of these, they will give you a spare. So, yeah, I really like how they add those cylinders for this set. So that is the only play feature. So nothing much for this uh, freaking set. So that is all we got. So overall, this set is still fine by me. So this is the cheapest Avengers uh, set for the lineup. So this is our second Lego Marvel accessory pack that we've gone before. The one from last year was the Spider-Man Far From Home Museum set right there. And the new one for this year, this is the second time that we've gotten so yeah this is the cheapest set and this is the cheapest way to get the new falcon minifigure now he is so freaking cool looking oh my god he is nice i totally love this brick belt wing pack that he comes with and yeah i totally like that piece it, it is so freaking awesome right there i totally love those uh, dual motor legs with the light red and the white right there as you can see which is so freaking awesome right there. I totally like the back torso printing and even the first and second face. The first one is the smiley face and the second one that I showed you earlier is more like a serious face in my opinion. So yeah, I totally love the golden hands right there that you can see right behind Black Widow right there. And yeah, it looks so freaking awesome. I totally like that. So yeah, I'm glad I bought this set back in September since the set itself arrived at September 19th, so yeah, it is so freaking cool like you will. This version of Falcon is not from the Avengers video game, it's based on the comics. Well, it would have been cool if they add him to the game itself. Well, I already completed the game already since I downloaded it on my Xbox One, so yeah, it is so freaking cool again. I'm glad they made a comic book Falcon right there. Well, they did one before, well, it was the Avengers Assemble version from Disney XD from 2014, which I never gotten before, but I like this comic book Falcon right there. And as for the Agents and Black Widow, they're literally the same. Well, Black Widow is still the same one from the Avengers Tower, the Helicarrier, and even this set. And the crappy Agents are the same too. I totally love this little small build, which is the Machine Gun. 
build right there that allows you to fire some cylinder pieces at green. So it usually fires out studs, but I like how they added these green cylinders. You can move it up and down like this, and you might want to be really extra careful to with these cylinders. If you lose one of these, like I said, they will give you a spare. So yeah, that's the only play feature. You can spin this gimmick and that is all you got for this set. So yeah, it is still a cheap set and it's so freaking cool looking. So nothing much to say, but I totally like this freaking set for the lineup. So that is it for now. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell, the save button, link in the description, and Hulk Smash that comment section down below. And tell me in the comments what you guys think about this set for the lineup. I'll see you later, alligators.